Hey all, thank you for joining me today. In this video, we're making the Halloween Pumpkin Transformer by Ellsworth, found on printables. Um, I thought this was going to be an easy build. It wasn't. There is tons and tons of sanding needed in this, almost three hours worth. But hey ho, let's crack on with the video. Now, I recently purchased the Bamboo Labs P1S and this printer is phenomenal. Um, I will be releasing an unboxing video shortly and a review once I've had a bit more time with it. But yeah, the prints came off spectacular. I'm using PETG for the black parts and PLA Plus for the rest of the body. Um, they came off really simple. It was clean cut and smooth. Just moving off the brim off the pumpkin shells um, as that's what it came with decided by the slicer but yeah the parts came off absolutely amazing no issues at all and yeah simple removal Now this was the first issue of the build. In a second, I'm about to snap it off. So there you go. Yeah, it's gone. I, as I was putting on the legs, yeah, well, I snapped one of them off. And the reason was this because I think it was the infill and mainly because of the way I printed them. So when I printed the legs, I decided to print it vertically just to test the bamboo lab stability. And yeah, it printed absolutely fine. But obviously printing it vertically where the seams were across the, the shorter side of the legs so when you bend it that's where it's going to snap and that's where it happened um, i reprinted everything well all the black parts anyway in the same esum ptg but i did it at 80 percent even feel so it's super strong now but it also made it an absolute nightmare to fit them in as you can see i'm struggling also yep i printed the orange parts the green and the red and sunny pla plus this video isn't sponsored by any of them but yeah just great filaments both across the board so yeah as i'm snapping it all together um i decided to stop doing the legs for now and just move on to the head which i did so i'm just screwing on the pump or gluing on the pumpkin stalk um but yeah in a minute you will see that i ended up sanding forever and there's also a nice little feature as my children wanted to join me.
Now, as I said, there's a lot of sanding involved. This was three hours plus worth of sanding. Just condensed that into this short eight minute video. Um, I had to sand each bit because it wasn't fitting in smoothly. And even after I sanded this all down, it was a still a nightmare to force it into the, the sockets, but it was worth doing. I'm just sanding now. Um, yeah, nothing much to it. I will let you enjoy the rest of the video. Now, as I alluded to earlier, my children are watching me do this and they wanted to join in and help. Thank you, kids. I do appreciate your help. I needed it during this because I was getting tired, bored, my hands are cramping with all this sanding. And yeah, really appreciate it. But yeah, there you go. Now, finally, after all that sanding, the model is done. Um, I forced all the legs in, it came out amazing. Even though I hated doing the sanding, I think this is amazing. Not only is it a transforming spider, it's a transforming pumpkin spider. And as it's coming up to Halloween, it was a great build to show, and my kids loved it. Colors look amazing, sun only, sun smashing out the park. And as always, it's time for the glamour shot slash animation. Let's go! Thanks for watching this video. Please like and subscribe. If you get a chance, follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Mr. Campbell Prince. It's been great spending time with you. So sweet baby G.